my game Come away. Come on, 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 Come on,
Well, first off, let me say I'm shocked because I was expecting this to just turn out to be another one of those, oh, the Ravens try situations. To be quite frank with you, the only reason I believe that they even going after Odell and that they made this push to get him is because Lamar Jackson's threatening to leave. And they starting to realize, even though the media doing a lot of dick sucking for him, doing a lot of caping for him, I, I, I think it's very clear that somebody in this Ravens organization, if not the entire fucking organization, realize that they have not done nearly enough for Lamar Jackson. And as many times as you get these people to hop on these YouTubes and platforms and, you know, ESPN and all the different type of Raven related um, podcasts, it don't matter how many soldiers you get to march for you. At the end of the day, this team has not done nearly enough for Lamar Jackson. I don't care how many soldiers you get to rock for you and get on social media and lie to the fans. I don't care about the doofus fans who continue to blindly follow this stupid organization. But with that being said, congratulations. We signed Odell Beckham Jr. Now, there's two things about this that I feel. And I, I can only be honest. I, I would love to get on here and lie to you. And like, oh, man, I'm so excited about signing Odell Beckham Jr. But if you was willing to go out to Odell Beckham Jr. after, what, a second ACL injury, missed a full season last year, why wouldn't you go after Odell when he was being traded from Cleveland? Why wouldn't you go sign him then? Because you needed a receiver at that point. Why wouldn't you go get uh, Odell when he was uh, on a trade block in New York? Because you needed a receiver then. My whole thing is, why didn't you go get top tier receivers? And I'm not here to focus on why they didn't go in the past, basically. I'm only using the past as a means to understand what's going on right now. And the fact that you sign an Odell Beckham Jr. off a second ACL injury, but you would not sign him before these ACL injuries, sign, it shows me that for one, you desperate to keep Lamar Jackson and show him that you're actually trying to do something to win because you haven't went and got him weapons over. I don't care how many times the Ravens get on the stage and say, we tried, we trying, we trying, we trying. That's the story of this franchise. And the only reason they get away with it is because, like I said before, you got a lot of moronic ass fans who will just peddle this stupidity, this stupidity for the Baltimore Ravens organization. But if this is a sign that the Ravens will stop being cheap and going to go and are willing to now go legitimately build an offense around Lamar Jackson, legitimately go out and get him top tier receivers, legitimately go out there and get him guys who can actually make things happen. This is the first time Baltimore has went out and signed any type of player that could actually help make Lamar better. And it's a big if. Because now you have to bank on Odell staying healthy for the year that you get him. You have to hope that he's still the same Odell, that he's still a game-changing receiver. Which is why it's strange to me that you commit to him now, opposed to before, when it wasn't as many questions attached to Odell. So I'm sure a lot of Ravens fans would say, if you listen to me like, oh, see, nothing going to make Saint happy. I'm just being real about it. So that if Odell don't turn out to be what we want him to be, a lot of people not jumping down his throat because this is a dude who done suffered two ACLs, multiple injuries in the last couple of years, missed the full year last year. Y'all call Lamar Jackson injury prone for missing the last couple of games of the last two seasons. So what are we calling Odell Beckham? Who got far more big time injuries and surgeries in his career to this point. Why are you not willing to go out and trade for DeAndre Hopkins, who to me is a more sure thing than an Odell Beckham Jr. right now? A.J. Green last year. I mean, A.J. Brown last year. A more sure thing. Um, Any top receiver, a Tyree Kill, a Devontae Adams, any receiver that they refuse to go out and actually trade for, like or, or Chase, uh, not Chase, not uh, T. Higgins. Receivers that this team can legitimately go out and trade for, they don't do. But now they went and did this and got Odell. So, listen, bro, I'm very interested in it. I am. We'll see what happens. Um, I'm happy Lamar finally got a legitimate weapon on the outside. I think this could do a lot for Rashad Bateman. Um, Yeah, I'm interested. Like I said before, 
I'm pretty sure Lamar Jackson will be a Baltimore Raven this year for the simple reason. The franchise tag is meant to uh, fuck up a player's entire market and whatnot. And you got these bozos who get on TV and tell you, oh, no, nobody wants Lamar Jackson. OK, we'll take the tag off of him. So, you know, a short video, but I'm happy to got uh, Odell. Happy to finally see a great receiver in Baltimore. But is he still a great receiver or will this be a story of a once great receiver? I'm interested to know. But nonetheless, I'm happy Lamar Jackson gets a weapon. That being said, I appreciate you for joining me on another episode of Kicking It With Saint. Tell somebody you fuck with him. Tell somebody you love him. You could be anything in the world. Choose to be kind to somebody today. Saint out. I got the moves like hot sauce. Lil' mama taking the top off. I'm laying down getting topped off. After this, she know she getting knocked off. I know she loving the money. So I keep on thumbing and thumbing. She say she horny when she take a shot, so I keep them coming and coming. Now I'm putting dick in the tummy, scoop her up like I'm raking the summers. You would think shawty red track, the way that she running and running. You getting dumber and dumber, you out here chasing the bone. After she finished from giving me dome, the Uber is taking her home. <laughs>